everyone, do you want to know how to make this really fun activity gym for your cat? Me and Rags have a tutorial this week for you for, some, for an, this activity gym that we think your cat will absolutely love. Okay, so all you need for your DIY cat activity gym is a hula hoop, some fabric of your choice, a selection of cat toys that can be hung up using either ribbon or thick wool, a good pair of scissors, and a big chunk of foam which you, we are going to be using for the bottom of the gym. And to put it all together, either a hot glue gun, a good fabric glue, or if you're a plumber plugs, unlike me, you can sew it, but um, I'm not very good at sewing. So I'm going to go with hot glue gun. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is take your hula hoop and cut it into two, two separate semicircles. Okay, so after cutting the hula hoop, what you want to do is take your foam and measure out how much you need by using the two halves of the hula hoop. Once you've marked it out, go ahead with your scissors and cut out where you have marked. Okay, so once you've marked out your foam, put it onto the fabric that you have and mark out where it is, just so that you've got enough fabric to cover it up, just to make it look a bit nicer. And then again, take your scissors, cut it out. Okay, so once you cut that out, I'm going to use hot glue gun, but if you're a lot cleverer than me, you can sew it on. So just attach the fabric to your foam. Next, take your two halves of your hula hoop, and if you want, you can leave them plain. But uh, what I'm going to do is get some more of this fabric and wrap it around the hula hoop halves um, so that they match. Okay, so now we have our two halves of the hula hoop that are covered in the same fabric as the base. Okay, so now time to attach our hula hoops to the base. Now get some offcuts of your fa fabric. Line it up with the corner of the foam and then cut out a little triangle like this along here. And do that for each corner of your base. Okay, then you want to take your little triangles and attach them on two sides to your base. Okay, so there we have, so we ha what we have here is four pockets at, the, uh, at each corner of your base. And so take your the two halves of your hula hoop and just slot them in. Okay, so there we go, it is slotted in. Now you can glue them down if you want, it probably will make it a little bit more secure. Okay, so that is, they are now attached at each corner, but to make it more secure, attach the two hula hoop halves together using um, ribbon or strong wool. Now to attach these, take your ribbon or your wool and just tie them onto the crossed over hula hoop. Okay, and here is our finished cat activity gym. Thanks for watching guys, I really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you gave this a go, please let us know in the comment section below and tag us on our social media at @relaxmycat. And now on to this week's competition winner. Rexy has decided that Revive UK has won the competition this week for exercising her cat on a lead. Get in touch with us at relaxmycat at gmail.com with your address and we will send it out right out over to you. Congratulations, you have won this catnip door toy for your cat. We hope they have hours of fun with it. Thank you for watching this video guys, we really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give us a big thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button. And me and Rex? <laughs>
<laughs> we'll see you next week. Bye guys. What do you think? What's your verdict? Comfortable? Yes.